instead of having to own all of these plus the Japanese version for the Famicom, you can have this. This is Super Mario All-Stars for the Nintendo Wii, which is also available on the Super Nintendo. This is a sequel to my game review of it, and this is packaging review. Alright, first let's start off with the basic. We can see that this is a very well-made packaging design, and you get a very nice cover, and a very nice cover you can touch and feel it. If you open it up, you can see, like, there's a kind of like a little thing in there that tells you about the games. And if you open this up, you see it right here, it opens, and you have two discs. And I'll explain what the two discs are in a minute. Now what's confusing is that the regular Mario game is in its white regular case. But the CD it comes with is in the red case. The red case should be the Mario game. And the white case should just be a, the regular CD. But anyway, let's take a look at the packaging for this. Alright, it has a very nice cover to it. And it has a back, which is just basically the same as this, but that's not big. And it says four classic Mario games on one disc. If you open it up, you can see the disc inside, and you have the instruction booklet, which is pretty neat, because it's like having the instruction booklet for all the Mario games. It's very neat, and like you can like re it's like going back in time, but anyway... This is a very, very neat, that's very neat, and I, this is just like a flyer thing, I guess. Alright, but anyway, that's just basically the packaging for the disc, but on the CD, it shouldn't have come in a case like this. I think it should have came in just like a regular CD case, that's it. But anyway, if you open it up, the disc is nothing really special. That's just a disc, and you know, right here we have a very interesting booklet, which I like. And it's like the history of Mario. It tells you about, like, the designer a little bit, and it has a lot of information about the games. Uh, here we'll talk about, uh, like, it starts off, like, with this picture right here of Mario's designer. And then we have, like, the history of, of Mario on the next page. And as you can see, we have the cartridge right there. And it tells you, like, uh, like history of the, the games in order. And we have, like, the little the planning sheet right there for the original game. But it's written in Japanese. But it's still very neat. The picture on it is of a Nintendo NES toaster, um, regular toaster, right there with some games around it. And there's an old TV set there that has Super Mario Brothers playing in the box for Super Mario Brothers. And it's a very well-made CD. And the CD is very nice because you get all the original Mario music plus, the more, mu plus more music from the Mario games today, which is very neat. Now you have all the regular stuff like Super Mario 1 theme, Super Mario Brothers 2 theme, Super Mario Brothers 3 theme, Super Mario, Brother Super Mario World theme. Super Mario 64, Mario Sunshine, Mar um, Mario Brothers, New New Mario Brothers, Mario Galaxy, Mario Galaxy 2. <coughs> Excuse me. But then right here we have a bunch of sound effects from the original game. And you have the coin, small jump, power up, one up, pipe, pipe travel, slash power down, hurry. Lost a life, game over, course clear, world clear. So it's a very nice CD. You get a lot of the music from Mario. And I like how it says, this audio disc cannot be played on the Wii console, not for resale. Well, if you already own a Wii, I'm sure you've already tried that and it doesn't work. But anyway, yeah. I just wanted to kind of show you the limited edition case for the Super Mario All-Stars for the Wii. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope you do make my video that I asked you guys to make about the um, Super Mario Brother Super Mario All-Stars. So, that's it, and bye.